The face of home entertainment has changed. And with this change comes a higher demand for data. Data that all must come through the same spot in your home. Cable customer premises equipment, such as set-top boxes, cable modems, and home gateways, must meet a set of ever-rising challenges to deliver the data necessary to support an ever-increasing number of devices. The DOCSIS 3.1 standard released in October of 2013 has stipulated strict requirements for consumer premise equipment in order to support the high demand for data consumption by increasing the data rates, channels, and modulation schemes. The PE42722 is the only RF switch offered today that can ease this transition and meet the stringent requirements of the DOCSIS 3.1 standard. The only switch to address an industry-wide challenge with cable standard transition, infrastructure refresh, and bandwidth upgrade. Today, cable CPE equipment manufacturers are making products that can only support one upstream-downstream band at a time. Current designs do not support dual up-down bands because, until now, no switch has met the DOCSIS linearity requirements necessary to support both. So in order to upgrade a service plan, a customer first needs to get a box that supports up-down band for higher data services. This requires a physical hardware change and the incentive to merely try out a better service is very low. However, because the PE42722 meets the new performance requirements, for the first time dual up-down bands can reside in the same box. Allowing the cable service provider to merely flip a switch and let the customer easily upgrade or try a new service. Why is this a game changer? Infrastructure upgrades are expensive and risky if the customer base has to physically change their equipment in order to try out a new service. But when a simple phone call is all it takes to make that change, it becomes much easier for providers to create a transition plan to the improved system. How is this solution possible? Each current hardware box contains a single upstream-downstream band, which is filtered immediately after the signal is received from the cable. In order to replace the two single bands with one dual upstream-downstream band architecture, a switch must be placed in front of the filters. Cable CPE vendors can implement the dual band architecture while meeting the DOCSIS 3.1 requirements if the switch meets the key linearity specifications of negative 115 dBc. The PE42722 exceeds these requirements with specs of negative 117 dBc for the second harmonic and negative 134 dBc for the third harmonic. It also provides high isolation of greater than 40 dB at 612 MHz and low insertion loss of less than 0.3 dB at 1218 MHz. The switch readily supports an average input power greater than 65 dBmV. In addition to the exceptional harmonic performance, this 5 to 1794 MHz SPDT RF switch also features low current consumption of 130 microamps. Standard 1.8 volt and 3.3 volt logic support. Wide voltage supply range from 2.3 to 5.5 volts. 1.5 kilovolts human body model ESC protection on all pins and small form factor in a 5x5 millimeter QFN package. The PE42722's unmatched linearity performance is enabled by Ultra CMOS, the only technology capable of addressing the linearity challenge of the future. Superior performance, higher reliability, exceptional linearity, Ultra CMOS switches.